Studio 209. With triple digit weather officially hitting the valley this week, Studio 209 wanted to give those viewers who may not have a pool in their backyard an exclusive look at some of the secret swimming holes throughout the region. Located just outside of Yosemite National Park off Highway 120, Rainbow Pools provides the perfect spot for those who want to cool off and seek thrills at the same time. As you can see, there are cliffs all around. The water is 30 to 35 feet deep, which makes it the perfect place to jump in. When I come out here, usually I'll climb the rocks, jump off Big Ben, and jump off Chicken Point just for the fun of it. It's scary when you're up there, it looks really high, but when you're down here, it looks like nothing. I've always wanted to jump off of a cliff, so this Came was my first. Came all from Ohio to jump off this cliff. <laughs> How did you guys hear about this place? It's uh, kind of hidden. Yes, and there's actually, I looked on the internet, there's a lot of hidden little places here in Yosemite, and this was the main one that popped up. I felt like if I didn't do it now, I would go home and I would just regret it the whole time, so I had to do it. And what really helped was the young guy that was here that is kind of familiar with the area who, who said it was fine, and I watched him first. Why are you doing this? <laughs> because it's hot out and it's fun and I haven't jumped off one in quite a, quite a few years. Oh wow. If my son can do it, I can do it. Amen to that. All right, well we will watch you sir. I heard it's pretty cold. Yes it is, very cold. <laughs> he wants to aim for the parts where it's dark because that means there's no rocks. 10 out of 10. How packed does this place get during the summer and can people usually find someone that knows the area like you said? Well, usually every summer people come down here from all over, you know, Oakdale, Sonora, all that. So this place will go up all the way to the bridge packed with people. We are here now standing in the natural bridge in Calaveras County. Now it's exactly what it sounds like. It's an actual bridge made of land that's going over the stream here and it provides for some pretty cool swimming spots. Did you know anything like this was in the 209? No, not at all. Like, this is actually very surprising. I didn't know that there was anything like this. I thought you would have to travel, like, by plane to get to some place like this, you know? I've been in Cenotes in uh, Mexico and Mazatlan, uh, but this is a lot better. It was 105 in the valley today, so we wanted to get out of the valley. And uh, this was a cool spot to come to. And, just the inside of this is beautiful. It goes all the way back and we can go out the other side and it's, it's pretty cool. So I was finally able to get in the water. It was cold but worth it. And now we're outside of the cave into the sun on what's kind of like a rocky beach with some relaxing wading pools along the stream. July issue of 209 Magazine, you can find info on not only these two spots that we visited today, which were the natural bridges and rainbow pools, but also info about God's Bath, Cleo's Bath, and the Arnold Brim Trail. So if you're interested on visiting some more secret swimming spots, be sure to check out that issue of 209 Magazine, which is out now. Honestly, this job is too hard. They send me to the ugliest places that are like so boring and like, I just want, just want a desk job, you know? Not. Nah.